Hi there, Chris here. So this is my entry into the Luck Fumbler 100 subscriber giveaway. Uh, he's given away a bunch of awesome locks. Totally awesome. And I will put a link to his giveaway video in a pinned comment. And so there's a couple ways to get um, entries. One of them is to go to his uh, entry video and put hashtag lock fumbler 100 so you can get one with that and uh, to get another um, entry on a second chance you can do a video with a with a tip like a beginner's tip something that's helpful and so I'm going to do that here I'm going to bring this um, Mingao back and what we're going to talk about is picking up just the first, just the first disc. <clears throat> and you can 3D print a set of these. And these are the ones that work the best or that I've found. Usually I'm using a 3.3 millimeter. Uh, you can hack off pieces of round big pen and make sure they're you know flat on both sides and these same dimensions do the same thing if you don't have a 3d printer um well how do you determine where the first disc is so we're going to look at that um so we don't have our spacer we don't know which spacer to use we're going to stick our pick in here and we're going to put it as far as it goes and then we're gonna back it off. And, okay, it's not tensioning yet. It's not tensioning at that point, but it is, the first place it starts tensioning and holding, that's where you wanna hold this. That's the hold off. So if you see here, this one would work. You can kinda of see that. Or, where's the other one? This one would probably work. Maybe actually I need a little bit thicker than this one. So we'll go up, go up one if I can find it. And that holds it off. So that's a way to determine which uh, off, uh, hold off you need. And you can still pick them without. I'm gonna try this. I'm not real good at holding it because the little offsets give you a little more stability, but we'll try this one because it's simple. So we're gonna read this key. This is, um, the last cut is not a zero cut. That's the one we're tensioning off of. The second one is a zero cut. So the second one our pick tip can pick is a zero. So we're gonna find that and that's in a zero. You see the play in there? That's what you want to see. Second one is probably a four cut or a five cut, whatever the, their system is here. So I'm gonna rotate down till I get a click. Okay, I got a nice click. See the play? It's really the same play as we have on our zero cut. So the next one is going to be a zero. Make sure it's in the zero position. And the next cut is going to be, I don't know, three cut maybe. So we'll find it and rotate it down. And it's binding very hard. And it didn't click. So, But sometimes coming back you get a click. But we're going to look for that click. And then we're going to look for the play. That looks pretty good. Let's check it against the zero that we know is set. Boom, boom. So that's that's pretty good. So we'll take the last, the last <clears throat> disc in here and tension off that to counter-rotate. So we'll go to the bottom, find it, get on it good. Counter rotate till you hear a click. Got a click. Turn, turn your tensioner, and we got it open. So basically, you don't need a standoff. It makes it easier in the beginning. 
And, <clears throat> but the way to determine if you're going to make a standoff or have somebody 3D print you one is just have either this, these formulae, these different ones for different locks, or just put your pick tip in. And the first, the first, you take your tension nose, and the first place it grabs really well is you're going to be, that will be the first disc. Or I mean, the, the, the offset to be able to tension it off of there. So there you go. That is my entry tip into Lock Fumblers 100 um, sub subscriber giveaway. Awesome giveaway. Awesome congratulations on hitting 100. You rock, my friend. All right. Hit the like, subscribe, leave a comment. Check out Lock Fumblers giveaway video in a pinned comment. We will see you next time.